We want you to work smarter, not harder, for your money. My name is Darius. And I'm Carmen. And we're the founders of Wealth Nation. When it comes to the way you think and the people you surround yourself with, it makes all the difference when it comes to making more money and attracting more money into your life. Oh, yeah. But before we get into the content, if this is your first time on this channel, this is Wealth Nation. And what we do is help you own your own lifestyle through a concept called infinite banking. And what we do is we uh, go over different questions and show you different techniques on how to grow and manage your private banking system. Mm -hmm. So make sure you go down and click that subscribe button and also hit that notification bell so you can be notified every time we come out with a new video. Mm -hmm. So with that being said, work harder Nope, work smarter <laughs> and not harder for your money. <laughs> it can be a little tricky. Um, the, the reason why we want to share this with you is because throughout our financial journey, Darius and I have grown exponentially. Because when it when when it if we're being real, yeah. um, we were sheep. Yeah, we were just doing what everyone else was telling us to do because we were following society's rules. Yeah, um, it's like the Truman Show, you know. So we were uh, we went to college and got good grades. The next transition from that was corporate America, and mm -hmm. in corporate America, you work really hard, um, you suck up to your boss, and you get another raise. <laughs> yep. So And then after that, all the instruction stopped. Yeah, and then it's like, <laughs> what do you do? Forty five more years of this? Oh, <laughs> hell no, no. So Darius and I were like, we cannot do this for the next 40 plus years of our lives, mm -hmm. um, it's just not gonna work. Right. So we started paying a lot of attention towards our surroundings mm -hmm. because we were in this discovery zone of what do we wanna do with our lives. Right. And I know what I did was I started looking immediately at my boss. So I was like, you know, the, the next step from this job is my boss's job. Do I want his or her job? No. Do I want his, uh, do I want their boss's job? Absolutely not because they're all stressed and they can't see their family because they're still at the office. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I knew that that was something that I didn't want for my life at all. Um, so understanding our surroundings, we just started seeing that we started realizing what we wanted out of life. Mm -hmm. And through that, we started attracting those things into our lives because we were now aware of it. Right. And um, just to go into the next point, what happened was we started noticing that we would bring our stress from work home with us oh, because yeah. of our surroundings. Yeah, yeah. You spend more time at work in most cases than you do at home. Mm -hmm. So it's more than natural for you to bring that those issues home with bring you. Bring the negativity home because right. everybody's mad. So <laughs> everybody's coming home mad. <laughs> so point number two is to, to surround yourself with the people who are doing the things that you want to do and making the amount of money that you want to make. Mm -hmm. Carmen mentioned that we got good grades. It wasn't always like that. Mm -hmm. What Carmen, both Carmen and I, we were in the sports. Mm -hmm. Grades uh, was a priority, <laughs> but not the main priority. <laughs> Something like that. Something like that. <laughs> so what we started doing was, or I know what I started doing was, I started surrounding myself with people who made good grades, made the grades that I wanted to make. Mm -hmm. And what happened was those habits started to wear off on me. Yeah. And next thing I know, I was on the honor roll. I was um, in the honor society. I was doing the debate team and all that other extra stuff. Mm -hmm. that smart kids do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so the same thing applies when you uh, become adults. What you want to do is surround yourself around people who are making the type of money that you want to make and doing the things you want to do because what's going to happen is their habits are going to wear off on you. Mm -hmm. And the most important thing you can have when it comes to wealth is having good wealth habits. Ooh, yes. Nuggets. <laughs> um, and we say that because we've been through this. Mm -hmm. When Darius and I moved from Houston to Phoenix, we moved with the intent that we were going to be real estate investors. Yep. And so when we moved to Phoenix, we surrounded ourselves in the real estate community. So we right. went to networking events four times a week. We were constantly networking, 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 and offering Offering people lunches and coffees and all sorts of stuff that's a good point to mention the people that you want to surround yourself with bring something of value to the table yes don't just tell those people oh I want to pick your brain can we meet no right. bring something of value to the table because it's a two-way uh, relationship right. and you also want to show them that you're invested in their time exactly yeah. exactly I know one thing that we did when we first started doing real estate we didn't make a ton of money off of it but mm -hmm. we learned <laughs> a lot <laughs> what what happened was we would start bringing you know different deals to the table and they would be like oh this deal sucks mm -hmm. well why 
they will tell you exactly why it's not a good a good deal mm -hmm. and what needs to be done in order to get a better one mm -hmm. so at that point we started bringing better deals we started getting better mm -hmm. at the crap yeah and it just doesn't apply to real estate it applies to everything everything, yeah. everything. Mm -hmm. exactly and, and it's just all about surrounding yourselves with those individuals and I know it sounds a little bit easier said than done how do I even go about finding these people just go research the internet we have Facebook and Instagram and all that stuff it's so easy to find meet up <laughs> yeah start with meet up it's so easy to find public figures in your area and yes. once you find somebody who fits the profile of the lifestyle that you want offer them lunch <laughs> I'd like to take you to lunch so I can learn how you built your empire and go from there or how I can help exactly how I can help volunteer opportunities are amazing there you go because those individuals again realize that you're invested and then they'll take you under their wing hey yeah. come to this meeting shadow this opportunity meet these individuals I want to put plug you into my network it just expands and then from there we were like see you later corporate America because <laughs> this is for the birds it's not what you know is who you know mm-hmm also yeah and the power of leverage the power of leverage because you never know those people of value that you want to connect with you you may have something of value that they need that you didn't even realize you had exactly so it's all about connecting the dots right. because when it comes to the whole idea of making money it comes down to problem solving yes all making money is problem solving <laughs> problem solving think about that when you make that connection when I made that connection I was like I'm overcomplicating this so much making money is about problem solving yes. so when you look at your surroundings what are the problems that you can solve mm -hmm. that you can then monetize because I mean a dog walker not not saying anything wrong with dog walking that is genius that is a simple business they ideology the they solved a problem you know the the oh yeah like we uh pay somebody to come pick up our trash for our door at eight o'clock every day because we don't want to walk to the all dumpster. we have to do is walk downstairs to the dumpster but we don't want to do it so we pay somebody else to do it don't judge us <laughs> but they <laughs> they solved the problem right. right that's all it's about what problems can you solve just paying attention to the surroundings that you currently live in right all right i think that's enough for today yes I really, really <laughs> hope that you like this video. And if this is your first time here, make sure you subscribe. Yes. And also follow us on Facebook and Instagram at WealthNation.io. And remember, own your own lifestyle. Or someone else will. <laughs>